today. Uh, would you introduce yourself, please? Oh, sure. My name is uh, Elizaveta Gotina. I study uh, biological science and technology in UST Kiss School. Hello, my name is Nazar Frankiv. I am from Ukraine. I enrolled in integrative degree in majoring in biomedical science and technology at UST Kiss School. Nice to meet you. Biomedical Humap, Kuigumap Chongong, Tomap Kajam, Chiraki Chai, Fong Wison Yirabanya. Panasigra. It is a maximally, extremely broad concept mm -hmm. of um, medical biological studies. It has side by side people studying not only biomed but also clean energy, semiconductors, robotics, computer science. Uh -huh. So this broad major unites everyone who studies fundamental biological studies or engineering solutions uh, for practical applications in medicine under KIST school. So biomedical major is like multidisciplinary field which consists of three sub-majors. Mm -hmm. My major is neuroscience. Mm -hmm. Neuroscience study here is typically uh, study between mechanism underlying human condition, mm -hmm. cognition and brain disorders mm -hmm. to a new treatment, discovery and technology. But in my case, my major is biochemistry mm -hmm. and that's a little bit different uh, in the way that our body mm -hmm. is just a bunch of chemical transformations. Uh -huh. uh, it involves small molecules, proteins, nucleic acids, and biochemists are the people who want to fundamentally study the processes that are happening, mm -hmm. find which ones are normal, which ones are pathological, and try to manipulate them with drugs, small chemical probes, and afterwards, once they, you take a drug, we want to know what's happening to your body uh, and to the drug, that it's safe uh, and that you can use it. Mm -hmm. uh, really significant part of biochemistry, for example, is the doping center here oh. in KIST, uh, who worked at the uh, Winter Olympics in Pyeongchang uh, yeah. for um, Olympic sportsmen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 공학 이렇게 세 가지가 융합된 학문인데요. 저희가 하는 연구는 신체적인 결함이라든지 이 난치성 질병을 보완하거나 대체하기 위해서 줄기 세포를 이용한 그 조직 공학 재생 연구 또는 이제 요즘에 각광받고 있는 그 개인 맞춤형 치료 진단 그 모니터링 키트 이런 것들을 개발하고 있는 학문입니다. I have a very uh, specific uh, specialization, uh, a one-of-a-kind specialist, uh, computer-based drug design specialist. Uh -huh. I am at the beginning of the drug design pipeline. My job is to use computer technologies and modeling to help modify uh, drugs, make them better, more active, safer, and easier to uh, manufacture, uh, mm -hmm. synthesize. And I work together with uh, organic synthesis team and biological assay teams who will afterwards uh, create the drugs and bring them to clinical trials. In neuroscience department, scientists make like a lot of cutting-edge discovery on the crucial topics. Mm -hmm. My tema uh, related to the mechanism of the depression oh. and how the specific protein are influenced on it. But uh, even in my laboratory, the topics are pretty diverse mm -hmm. because my uh, lab mates uh, work with schizophrenia, some of them finding treatment to the Alzheimer's disease, mm -hmm. some of them working with nicotine or uh, drug addiction mm -hmm. and so on. So mm -hmm. in the center, provided really wide, wide thematic mm -hmm. for the discovery of neuroscience field. So your specialty is depression? Yeah. Wow. Exactly. 저희 의무실 사람들도 각각의 그 세부 주제를 갖고 있는데요. 뭐그 온도 패치 개발하는 연구, 그다음에 이제 생체 재료가 이 체내 안에 들어갔을 때그 면역 세포가 이제 어느 정도 활성화 되는지에 대한 연구. 그리고 특별히 그 제가 하고 있는 연구는 이제 그 인공 각막을 개발하는 소재 연구를 하고 있습니다.
제 생각에는 이제 의공학이 워낙 융합 연구이다 보니까 학부에서부터 이제 배워오는 게 융합이라고 하면 깊이보다는 약간 넓게 브로드하게 배우는 경우가 많기 때문에 음. 여기 와서 이제 연구를 할, 하려면은 조금 더그 기초 학문적인 연, 그 공부를 조금 더 하고 오면은 아무리 여기서 논문을 통해서 그 지식을 습득한다고 해도 시간이 소요되다 보니까 약간 또 기본 그 기초 학문을 조금 더 공부하고 오면은 그 시간을 조금 더 단축할 수 있지 않을까. 기초 학문이라는 건 어떤 거 말씀하시는 거죠? 어, 뭐 세포면은 세포, 아니면 재료면은 재료, 음. 뭐 화학이면은 화학. 아. 이런 그 대학에서 배울 수 있는 조금 더 기초 학문을 조금 더 배워 오면은 음. 좋지 않을까. 네. 만약에 신입생이 들어오고 싶어 한다면은 저는 그렇게 좀 조언을 Bachelors, when entering the university, they often are uh, very intimidated. Do I have enough knowledge? Do I know enough? That's when you have to understand that your knowledge looks like a funnel. You should have very, very deep knowledge in something one specific, and then around it, it should be like also deep, not too shallow, but a little bit deep. So the question is actually, what do you want to do? Mm. What are you doing? What projects are you doing? Like in my case, of course, if you're doing drug discovery, you must know organic chemistry. That's period. Uh, mm. You can't do anything. But often it's like trending. Do I need to know artificial intelligence? Do I need to know um, this trending novel thing? The answer is no, not necessarily. If you don't need it for your project, mm. you don't need this fancy ribbon. Just think about what fundamental research you want to do and what you have to, what you're knowing around it. Mm. That's when you will succeed. Wow. Yeah, I think that newcomers should be ready for like hard but very interesting paths. Mm. Because it's not the easiest uh, life to be a scientist. <laughs> it's really tough and study and research sometimes become very, very tough. Mm -hmm. But uh, the feelings uh, after a successful experiment, when you like uh, get something that nobody knows before you, mm -hmm. is uh, really really amazing and worth it. So to the neuroscience, I like recommend the basis of like biochemistry, molecular biology, genetics, uh, physiology, and psychology. Wow! Is, uh, but you have enough time. You have enough time to learn it to get into your project. Just know that you're surrounded by the most passionate and persistent people that are going to guide you and get ready to work and work with them. Oh. First of all, I think I want to finish like PhD here. Yeah. Yeah, but it's take a lot of time. So <laughs> after PhD, I don't think a lot of what I will do, but I strongly uh, pointed that I will stay at academia for mm -hmm. right now, mm -hmm. like for conducting like basic research mm -hmm. and uh, teaching someone my knowledge which I will get mm -hmm. during this PhD. Like neuroscience is uh, really fundamental, mm -hmm. uh, whereas in my case uh, the choice between academia and the industry uh, is more often pointing towards the industry. Mm -hmm. Uh, I personally, uh, probably after a couple of years of postdoc experience, will go to either a computer software company uh, to improve uh, the uh, software that is being used for drug development, or I will enter a pharmaceutical company and uh, contribute to uh, drug design there. And usually all of my lab mates, uh, after graduating uh, as organic chemists they are highly valued in uh, companies uh, to do organic synthesis. 저희 전공 같은 경우는 뭐 회사로 취직하시는 분들도 당연히 계시고 그다음에 이제 그 포스닥을 이어가시는 분들도 계시고 뭐 국내에서 계신 분들도 계시고 해외로 가시는 분들도 계시는데요. 저 개인적으로는 저도 이제 해외로 포스닥을 나가서 조금 더 연구에 집중을 하고 최종적으로는 뭐 기회가 되면은 그 나라에서 그 직장을 얻는 것도 좋겠지만 뭐 한국에 들어와서 키스트 같은 이 출연연에서 연구직을 계속 네, 연구를 계속 이어나가고 싶습니다. 음. This is a lot of money, 
uh, time and effort <laughs> necessary, high risk of failure field oh. in which we work. And it's difficult to have that sort of commitment uh, to this field. And in order to do that, you should understand what is your goal? What do you want to do? How to improve people's lives? Where is your standing in improving uh, health? Usually it's healthcare. And once you have that devotion and that passion, then it will be much, much easier for you to uh, find a professor, uh, the methodology that you want to use, and um, have a good feeling about your future. And don't hesitate because once you have that passion, the professor will see it and he, will support, he or she will support you in uh, achieving really great academic success in case. 그 대학원 과정이라는 게 그렇게 만만한 과정은 아니기 때문에 당연히 충분하게 고민을 하고 또그좀 많은 것을 찾아본 다음에 선택할 일이지만 그래도 이걸 한번 도전해 보겠다 하면은 전혀 망설이지 마시고 학문에 대해서 충분하게 찾아본 다음에 이 UST 키스트나 다른 UST 그 기관에 연구하고 계시는 그 교수님들에 대한 그분들의 그 연구 분야를 충분히 찾아보시고 그분들에게 먼저 메일 연락 꼭 드리시고 그분들한테 이제 배움을 조금 얻고 싶다 같이 연구를 해보고 싶다라는 식으로 메일을 드리시면은 그분들도 그 교수님들도 전혀 뭐 꺼려하지 않으시고 기분 좋게 받아주실 것이기 때문에 네. Good luck to everyone <웃음> applying to UST. Uh, it will be a great journey for you. Uh, if you decide to pursue it. And I'm sure that here in UST Kiss School, it's one of the broadest generalists major that has special place for absolutely anyone who wants to study uh, biomedical science. If it's important and interesting, we have it in Kiss.